Okay, okay, okay. Before you have a go at me, before you've seen the title, okay? Anyone that knows me knows that Joey Jordison is the main reason that I'm on the kit. Okay, fair enough. So why are you not reacting to him? Why are you reacting to Jay Weinberger? Because Jay Weinberg is just as good. If it wasn't for Jay Weinberg, Slipknot fans know, if it wasn't for Jay, who else would we have had on that kit? At least Jay came on the kit, added his own ilk to the drumming. Plus, it didn't sound like Joey had gone. It sounded like Joey from the early days, which for me as a Slipknot fan, someone with a Slipknot tattoo, that's fine by me. Um, I don't understand why Jay... So, well, I see he gets hate. He doesn't get hate, but people are a little, very hit and miss when it comes to Jay and Joey Jordison. Personally, I like both. Joey will always have a special place in my heart as a drummer because he is the reason I drum. I mean, I even, with my band Scarlet Envy, through live shows, um, albums, um, EP that we've got, I use a Joey custom pearl snare. It's just how it goes. It's not... It is because it's Joey's custom snare, but it's because it sounds fat. Fat as fuck. But yeah, enough of Joey. Today is about Jay. There will be a Joey video. There will be. I'm just trying to find a decent drum cam video of Joey because everything seems to be in 144p. I'm trying to find a good one um, of him in the Slipknot days. I'm, I'm thinking Disaster Pieces DVD because that DVD is probably one of the best live music DVDs I've ever witnessed and watched hundreds of times. Um, but yeah, we are reacting to Jane Weinberg, as the title in the video says, playing Unsainted, um, a song that I really feel Jay finally felt like he had creative freedom. And it's a song that really shows his ability. I mean, I mean, if you haven't seen this video, the video speaks for itself. I think I've seen this video a couple of times, but it was—it's been a while. Um, but I don't need an excuse to watch it again. Um, so what we're going to do is we're going to do a little cheeky transition. Ah, and this, my friends. Oh no, 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 no! Before we get to that, leave a like, subscribe. Click that bell icon. You see the bell? Click that. Go on. Thank you. Thank you. No, no, no. Thank you. Thank you. But no, if you like the video, give it a thumbs up. If you hated it and you want me to shut the fuck up, give me a thumbs down. Whether you love me or you hate me, whether you like these reactions or you don't, please leave a comment in the comment section below. It helps me more than you actually realise. I need your recommendations. I need... I need your ideas, you know? This is... Like I say on my social media, um, on Instagram mainly, I'm mainly only on Instagram. I need your ideas. I, I want to do something that you guys have been enjoying. If it gives you 9 to 15 minutes of freedom outside of the real world with all the shit that's going on, I want to help. So yeah, this is Joe Weinberg playing Unsainted. I'm going to try and not get a lob on for this because this guy's are just... He makes me horny for drums, man. It's disgusting. Zildjian. Ah, oh, I've already said in videos I want to move to Zildjian. And he uses his Vader, Vader drumsticks. Oh, those toms. I'm gonna, I'm gonna be pausing this video quite a bit because there's a lot I need to talk about with this video. First of all, if you look inside the actual the mounted toms. There's actually the mic are actually inside. The mics are inside the toms. Um, and you can hear what kind of effect that has on the kit. It sounds echoey, it's beautiful, it rings, it just oh, oh stop it man. Also, I don't know whether you guys have ever noticed this, whether you watch drum cams or not, but Jane Weinberg's set list, if you look in the bottom left hand corner, it's like in reverse. So it's like black background with white font. I don't know whether that's easy for him to see. I've always been on, whenever I'm on stage, I always just use a normal way to use set list. But for some reason, he has it that way. I don't know whether that's his trademark. Um, I'm not even going to try and delve into the symbols because the geezer has so many. I'm seeing China cups. I'm seeing... F how many Chinas does this guy need? I mean, you always need a China. I mean, I'm trying... 
but band members of mine just literally are trying to talk to me talk me out of it but I'm trying to get like different sets of triangles on each side of my rig um, you've got one of the best sounding um, rides with the bell it's oh, this is another reason why I want to go to Siljan that ride with the bell the mega bell I really want one anyway yeah I think he, he also uses Evans heads which I'm not happy about because being a drummer you have your your preferences and Joey was a Remo guy and I feel like Remo should still be within Slipknot anyway stop waffling out you fucking idiot DW9000s that kick drum I feel like this guy percussion wise is single handedly just given Slipknot youth again oh I love this part. China, China. Ride. Crash. Oh. Say my soul. You can't not sing to this song. He slays, man. And also, one thing I do want to say, you can never have too much China live in a song. China, if I had it my way, every part of my cymbal setup would be China in, at some point. China's sound amazing live. When you've got a China that cuts, and feel so good. China's Alive are the best thing about a drum kit, along with a nice sounding mic setup as well. He's so clean on that on that pedal man. The Tom's ring. Go on, Joe. Those Tom's ring for days. Oh, stop it. I know you're going to get faster. Oh. Tom roll. That crash takes a fucking beating, man. I wonder how many crashes this guy's been through. Stop it. I'm sorry, but I want to quit drums. <laughs> this guy is, as I say, he's brought like a youth. When it comes to percussion, I feel like he's brought a youth back to Slipknot. And that's not insulting Joey. Joey's my boy. I've looked up to Joey since I can remember. He's a big inspiration of mine, but 
as I say, I'm, I'm sure Joey wouldn't have any harsh words to say about Jay in regards of his drumming, because his drumming's fucking fantastic. Anyone who says different, come fucking find me and prove to me that Joe, uh, Jay isn't a fucking great drummer, because you'd be talking out of your arsehole. Um, I mean, you can even go on, if you type in Jay Weinberg on YouTube, you can find him doing jazz. You can find him doing hard rock. You can find him doing fucking punk. You can find him doing metal. The geezer is so fucking all-rounded, it's disgustingly unbelievable. But yeah, I mean, I kind of regret making this video now because I want to quit drums. <laughs> I mean, I, I originally, one, once upon a time when, you know, this channel was drum covers, I originally wanted to do a, a cover of this. And then I used to get so fucking frustrated with a certain part in that song. And I learned it. But I played it so many times, I couldn't couldn't be fucked to film it. Because if any of you guys know, any of you guys that make covers or something, you play it perfectly fine without a camera on. As soon as the camera's on, you fuck up. And you've got to do take after take after take. It's just like that little bit of anxiety in the back of your head <gasps> fuck I'm being filmed a bit like my first video of the reaction shit how nervous did I look and now look at me I'm to my, myself now all these videos are unedited because I don't want to cut them down I just want to come on here you turn the video on and we shoot the shit together and we fucking we react to something and have a laugh and a joke anyway that's me I'm done because I'm the pressed as fuck now because yeah after watching that the drum kit sitting right next to me for inspiration and it's not happening right now so guys you just do me a massive favor click that subscribe button click that bell icon and give me a thumbs up share the shit out of the video as well it helps a lot more than you actually realize it's cliche but people wouldn't say it if it wasn't true if you didn't like it please by all means give me a thumbs down but what I do need you guys to do is leave a comment in the comment section below and just tell me what kind of videos. I'm getting your requests in now, which is perfect. This perfect. I'm getting so many different ideas about what bands to look at, what kind of genres of music to look at, what drum cams to look at. I've even had guitarists to have a look at. So, I mean, we'll delve into that at some point. Without, bye. I was about to say without further ado, I just cut myself up and said bye because I need to stop saying without further ado. Um, but yeah, I appreciate you watching the video. Come check me out next time. These videos will be on Mondays, Wednesdays, and Fridays, 7 p.m. British time. And I hope you guys enjoyed it. Appreciate you. Love you. Take care. Look after yourselves. Bye-bye.